Let's get one more check of the presidential race in Georgia. As we pointed out, former President Donald Trump right now with 51 percent to Vice President Kamala Harris is 48 percent. Now let's break down the newest Georgia numbers and here with Atlanta News first anchor Tracy Hudgens is Kennesaw State University professor Dr. Ben Taylor. Well, just like we've been talking about, it is tight. All right, Dr. Taylor, in terms of making up that gap here, we have about a little over 12 percent of the vote here. Um, the Democrats would need about 150, 175,000 votes to, to really take over the state. Yeah, at this point, it looks like Vice President Harris, uh, the remaining vote that's out there needs to be pretty sizably in her favor as it gets reported in. We'll have to wait and see if that happens. We do have several counties, Gwinnett County, Chatham County specifically, that are usually big Democratic vote uh, counties that have not reported fully, so we'll have to wait and see. Yeah, and especially when we talk about Gwinnett County, if you point that out there, you know, we still have some outstanding votes here, just a little under 30 percent. But Kamala Harris, Vice President Kamala Harris, would need to take pretty much almost all of that. She would need to take a sizable portion for sure. She needs to perhaps even do better than the percentage that she's done so far. All right, we will continue to watch. Dr. Taylor, thank you. Blair? Now let's get to some of the statewide ballot questions. Georgia Amendment 1, which authorizes a home property tax exemption, is projected to pass. It has more than 60% of the vote here. Georgia Amendment 2 for creating a state tax court is a bit closer in the margins. Right now, 52% yes to 48% no. As for Georgia Referendum A, it's projected to pass. This increases the personal property tax exemption in Georgia. We will be here throughout the night for Decision 2024 on Atlanta News First, and we can send you immediate election results to your phone. Just text the number that's on your screen right now.